Hey guys, uh, I have a fun video, another uh, World of Warcraft video about the uh, patch 10.1 PTR. Uh, spoilers, I guess. I mean, you've clicked on this video, so you're probably curious why I, talk, I titled it Class-Specific Weapons. Um, yeah, it looks like they're finally bringing back Class-Specific Weapons after, like, four years, I guess, right? Because the last time we got Class Weapons was Legion, so over four years. Um, it's it's weird. I, I wish they would give us more class weapons more because I love as you can kind of see from my class tier video class stuff and racial stuff are my favorite aesthetic in World of Warcraft um so yeah I thought we would just kind of look through this stuff so spoil warning but I'm guessing you're here because you're curious too and yeah I'm super excited because uh race and class stuff is my favorite aesthetic in Warcraft and those are the ones I collect first like heritage armor heritage sets you know yeah so here we go um scroll down and i and it does we don't know how we're gonna and it looks like hunter and evoker is missing let me go to full screen here there we go okay so it does look like some stuff is missing so i'm just gonna share with what they have um it's what's interesting as you can kind of see on this first one i can't no but it looks like the interesting enough it seems here the warrior one i think there's data mine too but you can see this is like a worgen aesthetic i wonder with like you know warriors i would say like hunters and rogues they don't really have a theme their, their aesthetic is more based on the uh, race you're playing right like a worgen warrior is going to look different than a human warrior a human warrior would wear like a knight generic stuff whereas a worgen as you can kind of see it has the rose petals the worgen face here which is so it's actually really cool Look at that, it's beautiful. But it has the Worgen aesthetic. So that's interesting that specifically for Warrior, they have like different stuff. I guess I can, I was gonna go through the whole thing, but I guess since we're on Warrior, I'll just do them first. Um, is this, oh no, see Worgen theme. So, okay, I thought there was two versions. So there's a different color here. I guess I can zoom in on it. So that's the, this is for protection spec, right? This is a blue version. This one's definitely more the Worgen aesthetic, right? Like, it's cool that they have two tents like with um, blue rose petals. Very cool. You can almost see, like, with this being blue, what other... What other... Can Worgen use shield on another race? I don't even know. I don't think so. Anyways. Yeah, so very cool. Um, but let's go back to the top and just start from the beginning. And we also don't know how we're going to unlock these. It's not, A lot of people are thinking the Mage Tower with the rework. I hope it's something else because um maybe because i it, i struggled i i only did one mage tower back in legion it was the druid to get the wear bear because i wanted it so bad but i struggled man those were hard for me maybe because i like i said I've, i'm a pretty casual player and i i'm not an amazing warcraft high-end player or anything so i hope they make them a little easier <laughs> we'll see um, just my opinion as a casual. I know people get upset about that, but alright, anyways, let's just start looking at the cool stuff. So this is Death Knight. And it says one-handed, two-handed axe. So the axe is two-handed, and these are one-handers. Look, okay, so these are one-handers, so I guess for Frost. Very basic, very cool. Let's just go to the next one. Different color scheme, very cool. Ooh, this one's definitely for frost right and i have a i have a frost. I, I usually play frost i think so this is awesome it's funny we just had we just got a bunch of uh yeah we just got a bunch of death knight aesthetics and shadowlands right so i mean i've collected more than plenty of death knight stuff but this is very nice very i say it's basic but it's not but it looks it almost looks like you can almost see these as like a fifth option for the uh, Legion artifacts. That's what it feels like. I could see this being a Legion artifact appearance. Um, oh, wow, look at that. That's very, uh, this is very unholy looking to me, except it has an eyeball in it. That's interesting. That's very void like, right? Maybe this is for unholy. I can definitely see this one being unholy because it's green and uh, purple. Those are the unholy colors where, you know, blue is ice. Um. That axe is awesome. I definitely love that axe a lot. Look at that, that's sick. Anyways, oh uh, yeah, that's unholy too. I can see that being, you know, green, blood. And you know what's funny? This actually, this 
axe kind of matches the um god uh, the first the first raid set denathrius when we fought denathrius the first patch of shadowlands it almost looks like this would match perfectly with their uh the raid set from there i can't remember the raid castle nathria castle nathria i think this would match perfectly with it oh oh i guess we can just kind of scroll through them see so yeah, i'll just uh okay the demon hunter once again this kind of looks like it could be one of the like a, basically a fifth option or a sixth option for the legion tier set it's very cool i'm not a big demon hunter guy but um it looks very nice and you get two tints for each one um i definitely this is the more generic this is very basic um demon hunter colors this is like a second option which is great so i'm guessing i'm guessing this is the tank one it kind of looks bulkier i'm guessing this is for the tank spec this is for the damage spec you know the illigan spec i like the uh handle part with the demon face very cool very cool oh and by the way i'll put a link in the description if you guys want to look at this stuff too i didn't do all this work i'm just showing it off but i didn't do all the work to data mine this stuff Okay, so now we're on to Druid. This is a dagger, so one-hander. Okay, so you kind of have the basic basic Night Elf colors, the green leaves. And then you, I would almost kind of see you have like the Alliance side, the green leaves, and Horde is kind of the light brown leaves, like Barons, Desert, you know, Trolls, Torrin, the Plains colors, I guess. So I kind of see like Horde Alliance. Or sorry, Alliance Druid, Horde Druid. Yeah. And then, oh, and this is like, I'm guessing it's not a shield, but I guess that's like your hand piece. So this is the caster druid pieces. Very nice. I, I love druids. Um, I think their aesthetics are very cool. Yeah, so I would say like Night Elf, Torn. Oh, and they get, um, okay, wait, let me just scroll down the luck here. Okay, that was just making sure. Yeah, this is, so they get a staff too. That was a bad picture, but here we go. So this one looks basically... We basically got this in, I think, BFA in that Darkshore. What is it called? Those Darkshore Warfronts that never went anywhere. <laughs> this is like basically a Druified version of it, but it has the same like moon aesthetic that I think it was just a staff drop from BFA. Um, Very cool. I, I definitely prefer staffs to like little daggers, at least for Druids. I think it fits them better. But yeah, I could kind of see a Night Elf using this one, a Torn or Troll using this color uh, scheme. Very nice. Very druidic. You know, it's literally a tree branch with like a moon thing on it. Like basically a moon onto a tree branch and then a littler moon wrapped with little vines or uh, yeah. Very cool. Okay. And then, yeah, this is mage. Um, Ice mage, of course. Very cool. Yeah. It almost looks like I, I can't remember all the Legion artifacts, but these all look very almost like a version of Legion artifacts. But I mean, it makes sense because that's a clash very basic just an ice staff i'm not a big mage guy but it is very cool basically an ice you're carrying around an icicle that's cool this is fire yep this is for the fire mage and it's it's kind of like the fang drill their their fire sword they got back then in legion it's cool that it's a dragon so it's at least a little bit i guess dragon uh dragon fight themed um, very cool uh oh it's just the same yeah it's just the same thing i like the gold one a little more um and then is this arcane okay yeah that this one looks more arcane i was like is this arcane it looks ice so this is like the bluish one um but this is cool it actually i think we don't have too many mage weapons that have the uh gosh what are, what's the mage what's the mage clan called why am i blinking out oh no <laughs> this is my my names are bad here okay what is it i'm gonna I'm going to cheat here. Mage. Set. I'm cheating. <laughs> it's going to bother me, and I, I get upset when I can't remember stuff. Kieran Tor. Okay, geez. I don't know. Sorry about that. I don't know why that was so bad for me. Kieran Tor. It has the Kieran Tor eyepiece on it. <laughs> Um, this part, uh, yeah, very cool. That would, that would have bothered me. So I had to look it up. Okay. Um, so yeah, we had arcane. We had the three specs, yeah, arcane fire. Okay. So monk, um, this is awesome. I'm so glad they're finally, 
it's so crazy that they added a whole new special animation for Monk, you know, where they kind of carry the staff on their back. I wish more classes had that animation where they can hold the, the hammer. Or, uh, it, like, sits on their shoulder. Um, Yeah, this is, I'm guessing, the tank spec. Yeah, very cool. I love this aesthetic for Monk. I love... I almost wish other classes got it, too, but it fits the Monk the best, right? It's like a keg. So this is their Brewmaster spec, I'm guessing. Very cool. I like this... I like the black one better. Um, and then this one, I'm guessing, yeah, the staff is for the healing, so Mistweaver. Pink. We don't get too many pink. I know a lot of people will like this. It's a pink staff, so we don't get too many pink colored staff, so that's cool. Oh, and actually from the top, it's a flower. Oh, I didn't, that's very neat. I didn't even notice that before. That's That caught my eye. That's cool. Green, that's basic color, jade color. Um, ooh, and then fans. I don't think we get too many fans. That makes sense for um, wind, uh, what is it? Wind walker spec. Very cool. I wonder why they're not in green, though. Well, I guess, when you think of Mistweaver, they're green. Monk is more red, and I guess the white tiger, right, is what they use. So I guess it makes it sense that this is white instead of like a different color green or something. Paladin. Of course, a big mace. Who would have who would have thought? Big mace. Um, this is retribution spec, I'm guessing. Yeah. Oh, that's great. So they kind of have the human, human blood elf aesthetic, the reds and the golds for them. Their mage. And then this is basically Eridar, or not Eridar. <laughs> drain eye colors, purple and silver is like um for drain eyes. Um, so very cool big handed mace. Retribution people like this. This thing is just a one-handed staff, or, or sorry, one-handed, uh, I guess these are both, I wonder if these would both be for, like, holy, I guess it's whatever you want for holy, because holy, I'm pretty sure they can use a shield and a two-hander, but, uh, not retribution, protection, um, very cool, same color theme, it's an interesting mace, I don't know if I'm a fan of that, I like that, this is just a basic hammer, this is interesting, I don't know if I'm a fan of that. The shield is great. Yeah, the mace, maybe not so much. I like the shield. Shield's cool. Um, big shield. like it a lot. Very nice. Aesthetic. I'm guessing Paladins will like it. What is this? Actually, I don't even know. Let me... Kind of could figure them out. That's... Pr oh, Priest. I was trying to figure out what this was. Okay, Priest. It's interesting. It's hard to get like an aesthetic for priest. At least I think so. I don't. I can't, when I think of priest, there's nothing that really comes to mind like, to me, at least. Um, same colors as paladin kind of make sense. They're holy, so. Oh wow. So yeah, this is like if you're holy spec or discipline, I'm guessing. And then this is like their void one, right? Purple. It has like that deep indigo purple. Very cool. Um. Yeah. Okay. Oh, and so, whoops, that's a staff. This is like a mace, right? Yeah, so they get a staff and a mace, makes sense. Same thing, red and gold is like the holy one, and then purple is the void if you're... This will look great on like a void elf or something. Um, oh, and they get a book too, that's great. I like the books are cool. Yeah, so holy spec, void spec. And I'm, I'm guessing it's not like you can... It's like with the artifacts, you can change it up. You can wear the void one if even if you're in holy spec you can do whatever you want i'm pretty sure i don't think these are restricted to your specs i was just thinking aesthetics like you'd, you'd probably use purple when you're in shadow form right this rogue okay yeah i was just making sure i wasn't sure because sometimes they use daggers for priests so rogue um very basic i mean yeah rogue it's interesting rogue warrior and hunters they don't have like a class theme right like i guess hunters use Rogues use daggers, right? So daggers, but the, the aesthetic of the dagger is hard to say for a rogue. I mean, these are just basic red. I mean, it's pretty cool. Blue. Um. Actually, yeah, I'd actually say I think this is more rogue aesthetic, at least for me. Like, I guess I could see this being... Who would use this as a race? I don't know. This one definitely gives me more horde vibes, like a horde rogue. Like, I can see an undead or a orc using these. Very cool. At least they give them two. Yeah, so they get two versions of daggers. Or I'm guessing one of these must be a dagger. One must be... I think this is a dagger. This is a sword. Because, you know, um, one of their specs only uses... They, can't, they don't really use daggers, right? The uh, outlaw rogue. 
Shaman. I love Shaman. So here we go. Shaman. So they get a fist weapon. Um, very cool. Very uh, Frost Wolf orcs. But I get this vibe, at least from the blue one. Or the lightning, like, because, you know, lightning and magma is the uh, Shaman aesthetic. So this is like the red one, blue, red. Very cool. Like it a lot. Ooh, I really like this. Look at that. Red and that. I like the blue one. Blue one's definitely more, at least my aesthetic for... I have an orc shaman, right? So frost wolves. Um, I love that. It's like a axe with a wolf face on it. This would go great with... I really hope they one day update the... Uh, I'm going to get out of here. Ten Storms Shaman set. This set. Man, I really hope one day they, uh... Yeah, I really, I see this, like, really, literally per matches perfectly oh, with, uh, this set. I hope one day they would, uh, update this set, because that would look, like, those axes would look great with this set. Um, anyways, very cool. Very cool. Oh, and then this is the, their, if you're a caster, they have you shields. The shields are great too. I, I love, as a sh I like Shaman a lot, and I think this is a great aesthetic. Very cool. Would look great on, it actually, yeah, even like, it even has little wings, like the Torn totem wings. This is a great, look great on like an orc, a, to a Torn. Very cool. Um, is this Warlock? Yeah. Okay, Warlock. Oh, I, I should have read this. Oh crap, yeah, it tells you. So it just says knife. Cause yeah, it would have given me an answer, so knife and staff, so dagger. I don't know why they say knife and not dagger, but whatever. Um, warlock. I like the red actually. So this is great. I uh I think basically like a bone with a little thing hanging off it. I like the green aesthetic more because fell magic. Very cool. I like it a lot. Um, and then this is their staff. I actually think this is very cool. This is very nice. I like this a lot. What I'm liking about these class ones are the Weijin artifacts were great, but they were some of them were very over the top. Some of these are, but I think these are more calm down class aesthetics, right? It's not super this, you know, a lot of stuff going on in the aesthetic of it. This is great. That's the red one. Oops. And then wasn't there? Yeah. And then the green one. This is like the green fell. I like the Warlock one a lot. And then we've seen the Warrior one. So yeah, I just thought I would make a separate video because I'm a huge fan of class aesthetic. And I think these were, uh, let me do that. I think these were very nice. If I had to rank, I like to just rank at the end. I mean, it's all bias, right? Because I'm, uh, it's based on the classes I like. I think Death Knights is awesome. Oh gosh, I don't even know if I could rank them. I'll just say I think the Death Knights was really cool. I think their aesthetic is great. This, it just seems... I'm not a demon hunter, so let me know if you're a demon hunter and you think this is cool. I think these are pretty good. They remind me very much of the Legion. At least these look a little different to me. Um, Druid. I like these a lot. These are... Different enough, I would say. I think these are different enough than the Legion artifacts, that these are pretty nice. I like them. I, I like Druid aesthetic. Except you're in shapeshift form much of the time anyway, so you'll never see them. <laughs> Mage, I thought was good. I like the Kirin Tor. I'm glad I can remember that now. Kirin Tor, uh, Arcane. Is that a... I guess that's a staff. Or it's a shorthand? I don't know what that is. Because it doesn't... It doesn't look like a staff and it's not a sword. It's just an... Maybe it's just an offhand. That's interesting. Anyways. Longs, I thought was great. Paladins was good. I actually think they did a great job. I think this flower where you can kind of see a flower at the top. That's cool. Um, Paladin, I think Paladin will like theirs. Priest was great. I like the Void aesthetic. Rogue, I definitely think I like these these bottom ones better than the top ones. Yeah, I'm not going to rank them. I, I can't, that's too much. But I definitely prefer the axes here than at least the, I, I would rather use these axes than the uh, claws. I've never been a big fan of fist weapons. Shields are great. Um, Warlock, I think the staff's a little better. Uh, and then warrior and i'm that's interesting that they're doing a worgen themed warrior i wonder if 
that was yeah so we'll have to see what happens but yeah i just thought i would make a class a video just showing this i know you guys can look at it but maybe you liked my thoughts on it i'm super excited i'm wondering where these come from i'm guessing mage tower but i almost hope it's something else but maybe it's just because i suck at warcraft <laughs> like i'm very casual i as i've said in other videos i i managed to get one done in legion but they were hard for me at least um, maybe because I, I think I did it towards the beginning. I didn't do it towards when I maybe if I'd done more when it was easier. Anyways, I um, hope you guys enjoyed. And yeah, I'm super excited to see these in, I'm guessing, 10.1 or maybe they're leaked for later on. Because I don't know. Yeah, unless they update Mage Tower, I don't know where we would be getting these from. But yeah, hopefully you enjoyed this and um, I'll see you in the next one. See you later.